Amad Santin Yako Benjamin, a purely a farmer now. I started this farm at the year 2008, and due to mismanagement, I even decided to sell the farm, or even cut down the mango tree and plant uh, cashew. Along the line that we met Horty Flesh. And thank God, when Horty Flesh came in, um, it has changed the environment altogether. One, we are not doing spraying. Two, they, we are not doing pruning. And for that matter, uh, the tree will bear fruit all right, but the, all the, the fruit will be aborted. And when we met the Horty Flesh, the pruning they did for us, the spraying, the kind of Adv uh, the advice they give us and the type of uh, chemicals they advise us to buy was in fact uh, the outcome of the change that, that we see. Uh, we start harvesting 2010. So from 2010 up to 2018, we did not even get a, a care from this farm, the harvest. Not even a care. But last year, that was 2019, we had a little uh, below one track from the farm. And that encouraged me that uh, if I concentrate on it, I may get something significant from it. And this year, for instance, we had a little below two tracks. So it tells me that there have been a tremendous change. The income that we got from the farm has actually uh, motivated us and it has let me know that uh, I can fully depend on this farm if I maintained the, the practices that Horty Flesh has taught us. Now we've even started um, uh, cultivating another mango farm. We've started with 10 acres just beyond uh, the, the, this place and by next year we'll start a plantation and also we've uh, invested some of the money and then also we've used some to complete our uh, housing projects. And the two is the financial stress that he has released the family from. Now our burden has been released and the family is very happy. <music>